Two. What's going on? Welcome back to Rainbow High Tea, everyone. Surely you've seen the Pacific Coast Dolls and Lily, the Chinese New Year doll by now. If not, take a look. I adore both of these dolls and can't wait to see their stock photos. Lily is stunning. I can't wait to see them in stores in January. Now we can get into the video, I've got three theories regarding the Pacific Coast Kids and Lily. We're stepping in for day one at Rainbow High. This is sick! The number one visual arts high school anywhere. First year orientations in 10 minutes. Rainbow High is unreal. <laughs> Fire! So we know that the Pacific Coast dolls go to an elite art school called Pacific Coast. I know, right? Many people, including me, have been confused as to why the dolls still wear Rainbow High merchandise despite not attending Rainbow High. Here's one of my theories to explain that, on Halley's towel the words Rainbow High Pacific View are written. The thing I want to focus on is Pacific View. What if Pacific Coast is actually just another Rainbow High location? It's not unheard of for schools to have multiple locations with different staff but similar curriculums. Maybe the school's full name is something like Pacific Coast Rainbow High, and that's why they have the Rainbow High emblem all over their clothes. I'm not 100% sure about this which is why I have another theory later in the video. Not amazing, but fine. In the episode The Sleepover Society we can see Jet Dawson sewing a piece of fabric. Upon closer inspection it appears that this fabric is used multiple times on Lily's outfit. What if Jet is helping Lily get ready for a New Year's celebration by sewing her dress? Or what if she's creating it as a gift for Lily? What do you think? We know Jet took a tour of East Asia, so maybe her and Lily bond over their appreciation for Chinese culture and traditions specifically. Allow please, the rules are clear. You've reached the end of your rainbow. Where is Bella? And how is she doing? Take it away, Bella Parker! I'm good. I'm home, back at regular school. After everything that happened, I've been doing a lot of community service. It's so important to give back. You glow, girl. So we all remember when Bella was expelled in season one. We still haven't much information about what she did while she was expelled, but we do know she went to regular school so probably not Pacific Coast, but what if it tends in the future? Either as a temporary transfer student or a full-time student. I think the first is more likely, because I wouldn't expect them to write off a main character like Bella completely. If Pacific Coast isn't connected to Rainbow High, maybe Bella brings some Rainbow High styles for the students. This could be another explanation for why the Pacific Coast students are decked out in rainbow high clothes. This theory is definitely a stretch but still super fun. What do you all think? That's all. Can't wait to see all of these characters in the series. By the way, expect another junior high video soon. Don't forget to like and subscribe comment for a shout out onto this video's featured fanart and comment shout out turn your color up